Glad to have you back. You're watching TVC News Hour. Well, Information Minister Alhaji Lai Mohammed says the successful completion of the second Niger Bridge project will change the socio-economic landscape of the nation. The minister disclosed this in Onitsha while inspecting the ongoing construction of the second Niger Bridge. We have details in this report. The first Niger Bridge is a very vital link to the southeast, south-south and southwest regions. The bridge, which was developed in the year 1965, has over the years experienced a steady rise in traffic due to the persistent economic activities on the transport corridors of the bridge. This is why the federal government began construction of the second Niger Bridge in order to ease the congestion and heavy traffic it continues to bear. The Minister of Information, Alajilai Mohammed, is excited at the pace of this project and he is confident that the ongoing project will continue without interruptions or funding constraints. The contract was awarded in 2014 by the last administration, but this administration has actually funded it to this level. The thing about um, this project is that because of the, uh, of the alignment, people from the old bridge will say nothing is going on. But you have come here and you can see the amount of work that's going on. So I'm very, very excited. Contract for the second Niger Bridge. It has been awarded in phases. Phase one has been completed, phase two completed, phase three completed. We are on phase four now. And this phase four constitutes a part of the main contract. It they commenced around the eight months ago. And it has a last span of nine months. So by July we should be ending with phase four of the second Niger Bridge. 605, 650 cubic meters of concrete, which we will do tomorrow. We were doing the piling, the steel piling. Piling is about uh, 30, 35 meters long, which will be driven in the ground. We do about two to three piles per day. Then we put the rebar in it, concrete, and then we start with the pile cap, same as we're doing it this side. The project, which is currently in its fourth phase, and is about 70% near completion, is expected to reduce the strain on the already existing Niger Bridge, improve flow of traffic, as well as create opportunities for the host communities. The project is also expected to be fully completed in the next two years.